Hi children, today I will discuss about the new topic decimal numbers. If you have learnt about decimal numbers in the earlier classes, just recall them. And for example, 253.015 is a decimal number this is a point is a decimal point and point in the right side arrow numbers this is a decimal part And point on the left side numbers means 2, 5, 3 is on a whole numbers. Then read the 250. 3.015 3 is a unit place 5 is a tens place and 2 is a hundreds place Point on the right side number zero is a tenth place. Then write in zero divided by ten and one is a hundredth place. Hundredth place. Zane one by hundred and five is a thousand thousandth place then five divided by thousand. Next, now compare in a decimal numbers, for example, 0 0.5 and 0 0.7. First, you compare in a whole, whole number parts. So, is on a units place, this is also a units place. Units place will be same. Next compare in a decimal part. Decimal part means a tenth place. This is on a 5 and this is on a 7. Then compare 5 and 7. 7 is a greater number. Then 0 0.7 is a greatest decimal number. And another example. 35.63 and 35.67 first you compare whole number part units place is 5 this is also 5 tens place is 3 this is also 3 and next compare in a decimal part so tenth place is 6 and this is also 6 next compare in hundredth place so this is also this is 3 and this is also 7 then compare 3 and 7 7 is a greatest number then 35.67 is a greatest decimal number
and we also know about addition and subtraction decimal numbers next i will go for exercise 2.5 Next exercise 2.5, first one which is greater. Then sub question first one 0 0.5 or 0 0.05. First you compare these two decimal numbers. Whole number part, ten, unit place is 0, this is also 0. And decimal part, 10th place is 5, this is also 0. Then compare 5 and 0. 5 is a greater than number. Then 0 0.5 is a greatest. 0 0.5 is greater. And point in the right side 0 numbers just there. Then values will be decreases. Next sub question to 0 0.7 or 0 0.5 once again 0 0.7 or 0 0.5 first you compare whole number part to whole number part units place is 0 this is also 0 next you compare decimal part 10th place is 7 is 5 then compare 7 and 5 7 is a greatest then 0 0.7 is a greatest then 0 0.7 is greater next sub question 3 7 or 0 0.7 In compare 7 or 0 0.7 7 is a units place 0 is a units place then compare units place 7 is a greatest number then 7 is great, greater next sub question 4 1.37 or 1.49 then compare whole number part means units place units place 1 this is also 1 next you compare decimal part 10th place uh, is 3 is on a 4 then compare 3 and 4 4 is a greatest then 1.37 1.49 then 1.49 is a greatest 1.49 is greater next sub question 5 2.03 or 2.30 compare these two decimal numbers 2 is a unit plus this is also unit plus both also same next you compare decimal part 10th place 0 and this 10th place is 3 then compare 3 and 0 3 is a greatest number then 2.03 2.30 2.30 is a greatest 2.30 is greater next sub question 6 0 0.8 or 0 0.88 compare this to decimal numbers units place is 0 this is also 0 next decimal part 10th place is 8 this is also 8 
and next come in the at least zero point eight zero on the consider zero point eight eight next uh, hundredth place is on a zero this is also eight then compare zero and eight eight is a greatest number then zero point eight eight is a greatest greater zero point eight eight is greater next coming to the question number two express has rupees using decimals sub question one seven five seven first you are already now in about 1 rupee is equal to 100 paise then 1 paise is equal to 1 by 100 rupees then 7 paise convert into rupees then 7 divided by 100 Then seven divided by hundred. Seven is a smaller than hundred. Zero point zero seventy. Again seventy smaller than hundred. Again had zero and zero. Then hundred seven is a seven hundred. Then answer is zero point zero seven rupees is the answer next sub question 2 7 rupees 7 paise so 7 is a rupees it already rupees alive then 7 paise na rupees convert madbeku you are already now in about 1 rupees is equal to 100 paise 1 paise is equal to 100 paise and then 7 rupees and you are already convert into 7 paise is equal to 0 0.07 rupees then add 0 0.07 rupees and the 7 paise place ke 0 0.07 rupees and the above they can already you can solve that then 7 plus 0 0.07 7 0 0.07 7 0 7 plus 0 7 then answer is 7 point zero seven rupees next sub question 3 77 rupees 77 paise so you are already now in about 1 rupees is equal to in about 1 rupees is equal to 100 paise 1 paise is equal to 1 by 100 rupees rupees 77 rupees is already rupees then 77 paise 77 paise is already rupees ke convert then 77 rupees then 77 paise na then 77 divided by 100 rupees and the book then divide 77 divide by 100 so 77 is smaller than 100 0 point at you one zero na hide 
सिक्स सेवन हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी हंड्रेड सेवन सा सेवन हंड्रेड एंड सेवन हंड्रेड सॉरी रिमेनिंग जीरो सेवन मैनस जीरो सेवन आलरे पॉइंट हाकी डायरेक्टी जीरो हाकबूद हंड्रेड सेवन सा सेवन हंड्रेड देन आंसर इज जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन सेवेंटी सेवन रुपी प्लस जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन रुपी सेवेंटी सेवन रुपी प्लस जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन रुपी आर दिस नंबर सेवेंटी सेवन रुपी प्लस जीरो पॉइंट सेवन सेवन इतना टेन्थ प्लेस हंड्रेड प्लेस सो पॉइंट करेक्ट आगे देवन सेवन पॉइंट सेवन प्लस जीरो सेवन जीरो इज ए यूनिट प्लेस अंड सेवन इज ए यूनिट प्लेस प्लेस नोडक नंबर हाकु देवन देवन सेवेंटी सेवन पॉइंट सेवन सेवन रुपी नेक्स्ट सब क्वेश्चन फोर फिफ्टी पैसे इवर आल ना अबउट वन रुपी इक्वल टू हंड्रेड पैसे वन पैसे इक्वल टू वन बै हंड्रेड रुपी देन कन्वर्ट फिफ्टी पैसे फिफ्टी डिवैड बै हंड्रेड इज इक्वल टू दिवैड फिफ्टी डिवैड बै हंड्रेड देन जीरो पॉइंट जीरो एड वन जीरो हंड्रेड फाइव जा हंड्रेड देन आंसर इज जीरो पॉइंट फाइव रुपी आर फिफ्टी डिवैड बै हंड्रेड देन फिफ्टी वन जा फिफ्टी टू जा इज इक्वल टू वन बै टू वन बै टू मीन जीरो पॉइंट फाइव रुपी नेक्स्ट सब क्वेश्चन फाइव टू हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी फाइव पैसे यूर आलरे नौ अबउट वन रुपी इज इक्वल टू हंड्रेड पैसे वन पैसे इज इक्वल टू वन डिवैड बै हंड्रेड रुपी देन टू हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी फाइव पैसे इज इक्वल टू हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी फाइव डिवैड बै हंड्रेड रुपी Then divide two hundred and thirty-five divided by hundred. Hundred two is two hundred remaining five three. So thirty-five is a smaller than hundred. Then apply point and add zero. Hundred three is three hundred zero five minus. Zero five three minus three zero then fifty fifty is smaller than hundred. Already now point apply mad divi then write zero hundred five is five hundred. Then answer is two point three five rupees. is the answer